Hey viewers, have you ever tried to remove one of these removable brake studs? Um, they're just a real pain. Well, if you try to remove one that's not removable, then you have a lot of problems. But even the removable ones are just a real pain. Uh, they're just really tight. And I don't know what size these flats are supposed to be. If you use an eight millimeter wrench, it's just too tight, it doesn't fit on there. A nine millimeter wrench, on the other hand, is loose. So, and if you try to remove it with an, an open end nine millimeter wrench, uh, almost all the time you're going to round those edges off. It just doesn't uh, grab on there. You can use vice grips, but you're just going to mar the heck out of it. So I'm going to show you the best tool to remove these things with. This is an extreme grip adjustable wrench from Craftsman. It's kind of a cross between an adjustable wrench and a vice grip. You know, so uh, a lot of people give me flack about using adjustable wrenches. Well, this is kind of an adjustable wrench on steroids. So what you do is you kind of find the flats on there, use the adjustable wrench to clamp onto the flats like this, and then use the vice grip part here and then it clamps down nice and tight onto there. So you get a nice solid grip on those flats. Now, just go ahead and rotate it and it starts turning without like slipping on the thing there. But getting broken loose is the, the, is the hardest part. Once you get it broken loose, then generally they come out pretty uh, easily. You know, there's a bit of resistance. And so you just have to work it out. But anyway, this tool is just friggin' awesome. And I'm gonna, I'll am post a link to it on Amazon in the description. Go check it out. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful or interesting. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel, click the subscribe button. Be sure to click the little bell so you get notified of new videos that come out. I'm always coming out with new videos. I'm over on Facebook, RJ the Bike Guy. Go over there, like that page. I post a lot of stuff over there. And I have a webpage, rjthebikeguy.com. Go check that out as well. Anyway, thank you much for watching.